Okay, Saturday, here's my pickups for today. Uh, everything here uh, represents $158 in spending in me. We went to about 10 sales today. Uh, it's that time of year, there's just aren't as many sales, even where I am. And uh, I went to every one that I could, and uh, I found some stuff. You know, it, it wasn't too bad. Uh, let me just go through, and I'll try and do... Well, here we go. I bought this tripod for uh, $15, and this one's unusual. The reason I bought it is because it has like a fluid head. Um, that goes real smooth. You can just like turn and it's like real slow smooth motion, not jerky. It's, it's a video one. But it has a weird remote control and I have no clue what that is. I'm going to look it up online. Um, it, apparently it plugs into the camera and you can use it as a zoom on the handle. Now I've got a feeling that um, this w doesn't really matter actually. Uh, um, unless this is worth like $75 or $100 on eBay. I'm just going to use it for myself. And um, it was for a Sony VCT-87ORM camera. Whatever. Got some clothes. Always a good deal. If you get them uh, for a dollar pair of jeans. Got these. I paid a dollar a piece for these. These are actually uh, Lucite stands for jewelry. Wife uses these. Come in really handy. Bracelets and uh, necklaces. Uh, if I had to buy them in the store, they would be like anywhere from 10 to 20 I'm not really sure. I don't remember. But between the 10 and $20. Uh, bought this African mask for a dollar. This I'll put away and I'll take it to the markets I do in the summer. Um, got a... Targus power inverted, 100 watts. These you plug into your car, and they provide you with uh, charging. You can um, it, there's a power supply for computers, uh, cameras, uh, probably uh, well there it says laptop, cell phone, and just um, computer stuff like that. This I only paid three dollars for this. This oh there it is. No, it was only like seventeen dollars in the store. Well it says compare at thirty. All right, sometimes um, at the rest stops those are like thirty, forty dollars. Um, I bought a sack of DVDs, blind uh, dollar a piece. I picked the ones I wanted, and all of them were in good shape. I didn't even look at them. This one wasn't. Uh, it's going to be a throwaway polish. Got a few CDs, mostly uh, Broadways, but they were only 50 cents a piece. Um, this, I don't know if you've ever seen these. Uh, these are called sil silhouettes. This one has uh, foil in it, and uh, if I were to put this on eBay, I'd probably get like... Uh, see, that, that's what the back looks like. Uh, Colonial History printed. You can look these right up, BE25. And this is probably worth 35 or so, but I don't think I'd put it online. I would just sell it at a flea market. Odds are it's not worth much more than that. Um, here's the jewelry. Oh, here's the games I got. Buck a piece. Uh, uh, some nonsense uh, DS games. I got Smart Boys, Camera Room, Big Brain Academy. I know these are, aren't worth much, and I'll probably sell them at the flea markets for five bucks a piece. Gourmet Chef and America's Test Kitchen. Uh, if I'm lucky, one of them might be worth putting on Amazon, but I really doubt it. Um, I'm going to do the DVDs last because uh, that's my friend and, and anybody who's not interested in stuff can tune out. Most of the jewelry today we did not pay too much for. Um, and it's nothing special. Here's like a, a cameo locket kind of necklace, uh, $3 and 3 So we'll probably sell these like in the $8 to $10 range. Uh, here's another cameo pin. We paid 4 We'll probably sell it 8 to 10 uh, This one... We paid three. We will probably sell it eight to ten. We got some cameo bracelets with um, fake mother pearls, and those will probably sell. Oh, the one's picking up. We'll probably sell those for about five a piece. Got three of those. Um, let's see. Got this big uh, bangle bracelet clamper. I don't know what we paid for that. I think we paid a dollar. Yeah, one shell we rolled up, we paid a dollar, and the other one was a church sale. Don't know where we got this. This uh, looks like silver, but I don't think it is. Uh, owl pin. Um, this is just a nice uh, tiger's eye bracelet. We paid two dollars, I think. And uh, two dollars will probably sell for five. This is neat. This is like a jade or jade stone. Yeah, this stuff is blown away. <laughs> weigh that down. Um, this is probably something we'll sell ten to fifteen dollars. Um, just a big um, gold tone black necklace with a heart. We'll probably sell that eight to twelve dollars. Uh, just some earrings, it looks like. I don't know what the deal is with that. Um, going through. Here's a, a cameo ring. See, we bought all the cameo stuff at this uh, little church sale. And people pass this up because they're really looking for gold and silver 90% of the time. And we like things like that that we'll sell at, like, maybe double our money, small profit. So, anyway, this one has, like, uh, like you, you can see it. It's like where they did that uh, weaving of that. Um, here's some earrings. I think we paid a dollar for them. And they're owls, kind of funky, kind of cool. Um, just more earrings with birds. Uh, I think we paid a dollar. And these are probably just more earrings. We paid a dollar for those. They, they, some of them might be for my daughter. And this is probably the best uh, 
well, I don't, I'm not going to say it's the best buy jewelry wise, but at least this is worth probably 20 or, or more dollars. And because they're 14 karat gold and they're little ladybugs, I don't know if you can see them. Um, that's the only gold or jewelry like that we found today. Um, they're so small, I don't think they're really eBayable, but um, you know, it is what it is. All right, I'm going to go through the DVDs. These are the ones I'm holding for myself. I mostly do this for my friend. I want to see Eddie Murphy Delirious. I want to see House of 1000 Corpus, Corpses. And I want to see this Untamed Dice Rules. I'm looking forward to watching that. I used to like Andrew Dice Clay. For my friend, dollar piece, the stack of DVDs, I bought 87 so I spent $87 on that. Uh, Talladega Nights, uh, Exorcism of Emily Rose, Forgetting Sarah Marshall, Phantom of the Opera, Finding Nemo, Shrek 2, Uncle Buck, uh, 21 Grams. Little Nicky, Poltergeist. They had a lot of Adam Sandler movies. It must have been Fast Times, Ridgemont High. Roadhouse. I just want to kick stuff after I watch that movie. Uh, Van Helsing, Time to Kill, Young Guns. And actually, the Young Guns 2 I, two I, I bought today. I don't, look at all those famous people on that. Um, full Metal Jacket. Look, I got a bag. It's blown away. <laughs> I got to go get that later. Uh, a Few Good Men, Dracula, Spaceballs, Pulp Fiction. This one's blown away, too. Uh, School of Rock, Goodfellas, Superbad, I Love You, Man, uh, Borat, um, Chasing Amy. I don't know if you're familiar with uh, this guy here. I've been watching the show Comic Book Men. Uh, I forget his name. Uh, Ghost, Grease, Dirty Dancing, uh, Kindergarten Cop, Lost Boys, Sin City, uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, uh, one Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, X2. You see, I got a decent selection of movies. From Dust Till Dawn. This movie is a fantastic movie if you've never seen it. Uh, Johnny Depp, Sweeney Todd. I didn't really like that. Well, it was good, but eh. if you like Johnny Depp, though, you got to see it. Mole Rats, excellent movie. Shaun of the Dead, Labyrinth with David Bowie. Uh, I think it's Sealed, too. Knocked Up, Stephen King's It, The King and I, The Grudge, Clueless, um, Waterboy, um, Men in Black 2. A Brady Bunch movie, kind of a fun movie, kind of mocking the whole TV show. Anger Management, The Goonies, uh, Beer League, I saw that, it was kind of funny. Uh, the House Bunny, I like this, anything she does, I, I always find she's hysterical. Animal House, I may want to see that again. Um, Fast Times Ridgemont High, Sealed Poltergeist, not that that matters. Another good movie, uh, as usual su Suspects. Um, this is probably Adam Stephen Baldwin's be best performance when he goes like, "Give me the fucking money!" Like totally cracks me up every time he does it. Uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, Pretty Woman, about last night. Uh, Ace Ventura, Pet Detective, the number one. Pacino, Scent of a, a Woman. Apparently, women smell like hoo ha. Uh, Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, Billy Madison, Meatballs, Fifty uh, First Dates. This is actually a really good movie. Um, well. Anchorman, because the new Anchorman's coming out. Travis uh, Tritt, Live and Kickin'. Uh, Tom Hanks, Boris Gump, a movie that should be seen by everyone. Caddyshack, a sealed, hysterical movie, Cat in the Hat. Uh, more Adam Sandler, Happy Gilmore, Big Daddy. Uh, Devil's Advocate, I don't even know why I bought this. this uh, Stand By Me, uh, Inglorious Bastards, good movie. My friend is always talking about the German guy in it that uh, won an Oscar or something. This is uh, your iconic uh, Christmas movie, Christmas Vacation, Last National Foods, Batman Begins, Breakfast Club, everyone should see that movie, Good Will Hunting, overrated movie, I Know What You Did Last Summer, um, Hamlet, it's sealed, uh, Tom Cruise, War of the Worlds, not really a bad movie, and Young Guns too. And uh, yeah, that covers everything I got today.